I don't know about you, but I always thought that on most days Barbès Rochechouart would look best in a gritty black and white. Paris, home to the second busiest subway system in Europe, sees 4.2 million metro passengers a day. And watching all of that passenger traffic is Michael Hollerer, a German filmmaker who has been filming Parisian metros for the past few months in an effort to reveal a true city life. So I wanted to discover new places and rediscover all the places I've already been to, so I thought I could start a series and going all over town. Paul Overer has observed it all. From the homeless to the tourists to the Parisians in a rush, his project has given him the ultimate spectator position to view the city. Uh, but but uh, what's really striking are those people in distress. That's what you don't usually see in, in the Paris documentary, what you uh, think Paris is about. There are over 300 metro stations in Paris, making it one of the densest subway systems in the world. Uh, so far I've done 138 from 300, I think it's 304 stations in, in Paris. Through this project, Hoa has opened people's eyes to the behind-the-scenes shots of Paris that tourists can't necessarily experience. And that's what I want to share, that Paris is much more than just the Eiffel Tower or the, the Louvre and, and, and those things. In an era of truly rapid transit, Hoa has mastered the art of living in the moment, even in the Parisian underground. Ariel Dalzer, AUP7.